This royal wedding was a massive event in Brunei. It attracted much attention worldwide because Prince Abdul Mateen is a social media star with 3 million followers on Instagram. But who is his wife and why did she have to delete all her social media accounts? Keep watching the WOW channel to find out interesting details about the new Princess of Brunei and to check out her rare photos. The royal wedding in Brunei lasted 10 days, according to estimates from various information resources. It was an incredible event that could cost about 100 million dollars. However, this amount is insignificant for the Sultan of Brunei, Hassan Bolkia. After all, his fortune is approximately 30 billion dollars, because his country is rich in oil and gas. The Sultan of Brunei adores his son, Prince Abdul Mateen, who is the youngest child in his second marriage to former heir hostess Mariam Abdulaziz. The Sultan divorced his second wife long ago, but the children from this marriage remained to live in the palace and enjoy all royal privileges. Prince Abdul Mateen is one of the Sultan's favorite sons. Even though the prince is one of the youngest children in the Sultan's royal family, he has recently often accompanied his father on business trips worldwide. Prince Abdul Mateen is pursuing a career as a diplomat and is the face of power in Brunei. He is young, handsome, athletic and successful. That is why 3 million people have already subscribed to him on Instagram. The prince enjoys being a social media star. He happily shows off his muscular torso and photos of his trips to different countries. His life is very eventful and full of impressions. Probably many girls would be happy to become his girlfriend, but they didn't have a chance. For a long time, since a few years ago, the prince gave his heart to a beautiful Bruninian girl named Anisha Rosna. Who is this beauty? And how did she manage to fall in love with a handsome Asian prince, who was once on the list of the most eligible bachelors in Asia? I have researched a lot of information about the new princess of Brunei, and the most surprising thing is that she has no social media accounts. Agree, it is a little dramatic when the wife of a prince who is a social media star becomes a woman who does not have a single account on social networks. But there are reasons for this, and I'll discuss them later. In the meantime, let's find out who this girl is and how she managed to become a member of the Brunei royal family, which is considered one of the richest in the world. Anisha Rosna does not have a royal origin, but her relatives have a very high position in Brunei. She was born in London on November 6, 1994, to a Bruninian mother and Croatian father, Adam Issa Kalibic. She has three siblings, Daniel, Marina and Adris. Anisha's parents divorced long ago in a big scandal. The long legal battle between Anisha's parents has been well documented. Some people consider Anisha's father to be an abuser. However, despite the family scandals, Anisha's parents were invited to her wedding and portrayed a good family. That is why their names are usually rarely mentioned in the girl's biography. But people talk a lot about her outstanding grandfather, Pehin Dato Issa, who was very successful in Brunei. She is the granddaughter of a former advisor to the Sultan of Brunei. Her grandfather was also a prominent government figure. He was appointed Deputy Attorney General and Deputy Prime Minister in 1970 and 1986, respectively, and is believed to be the founder of Royal Brunei Airlines. Unsurprisingly, since childhood Anisha Rosna was familiar with the royal family and often visited them, she met Prince Martin when they were still children. We learned this thanks to the fact that Prince Abdul Mateen himself recently published a photo together with Anisha when they were still very young. So it's hard to call Anisha a modern Cinderella. She grew up in a wealthy family and was close to the royal family. 
Anisha Rosna's brother, Daniel, has constantly been spotted beside Prince Abdul Mateen at gatherings and events. The two are said to be childhood friends and share a mutual love for Paula. Anisha has also traveled extensively and received an excellent education from the best universities in Europe. She, alongside all of her siblings, attended Jurodong International School. She attended the University of Bath in the United Kingdom from 2013 to 2017 to pursue European studies in French and Spanish. She also completed a semester at Complutense University in Madrid with a work placement in Paris. At a young age, she rode horses and played musical instruments, including piano, violin, and guitar. Even though Brunei respects tradition and lives according to the laws of Islam, Anisha Rosna does not wear a hijab and leads a Western lifestyle. At the time of the wedding, she was 29 years old and had managed to make a career in business. According to an artist, article published in Esquire, she became the owner of the fashion label Silk Collective and a co-founder of Authentary, a travel agency that provides cultural experiences across many countries. In her official biography, Anisha is described as a successful businesswoman. However, according to media insiders, Anisha became famous in her circles primarily as a party girl and not as a purposeful career woman. Before her wedding to the Prince of Brunei, professional PR people did a good job on her image. Anisha showcases her sophisticated dressing style. She loves fashion brands and often attends international fashion shows herself. She was spotted attending the Elisa Abbott Couture show at the 2023 Paris Fashion Week with Prince Abdul Mateen's cousin. Princess Anisha has a favorite hobby. She loves to cook and do fitness. Once upon a time, a girl started a page on social networks to share culinary recipes with subscribers. Agree, this is such a cute and useful hobby. What could be more pleasant than delighting family members with home-cooked dishes? However, Anisha had to delete all her social media accounts because she was subjected to cyberbullying and harassment on social networks. Users wrote her unpleasant comments, which negatively affected her well-being, according According to rumors, Anisha had facial paralysis. Due to all the online harassment and bullying she had to endure, the bad words came after rumors that Anisha was dating Prince Martin began gaining traction online. But why did this beautiful, well-educated girl from a good family cause so many negative comments? I can make a few guesses. Firstly, Prince Abdul Mateen is a very handsome and wealthy man whom millions of girls dream of. Unsurprisingly, his fans could write negative comments to Anisha out of jealousy. Secondly, users might be confused by the fact that the girlfriend of the son of the Sultan of Brunei leads a rather frivolous Western lifestyle. Let me remind you that the Sultan of Brunei tried to introduce Sharia law into his country, which implied severe punishments. According to these laws, adultery and homosexual relations should be punished by stoning, and theft is punishable by cutting off a hand. Against this background, the frivolous relationships of the Sultan's son, Prince Martin, who dated a girl out of wedlock and led a Western lifestyle, could irritate the public. This is why Anisha Rosna may have received negative comments on social media. However, everyone has long been accustomed to the fact that the Sultan of Brunei has absolute power. Therefore, this country's strict laws must first be observed by ordinary people people, and members of the Sultan's family can live as they want. Also, users' adverse reactions could have been caused by suspicions that Anisha Rosna could be a gold digger. She is so lucky to be a member of the Brunei royal family, which has billions of dollars in its accounts. 
I could go on and on about how rich the Sultan of Brunei is. His family enjoys incredible luxury. They live in the largest palace on the planet, which was even included in the Guinness Book of Records. The Sultan has the most extensive collection of rare cars and owns his own jets and yachts. Many girls would dream of being in Anisha's place. No wonder many people envy her. However, any girl of Prince Martin could have aroused these suspicions. This couple's relationship looks quite sincere, like true love, because they have known each other for a long time and have many common interests. We don't know exactly how this relationship developed. The couple began dating several years before their engagement was announced. Several times they appeared together as boyfriend and girlfriend at official events, such as Princess Azima's wedding in January 2023. Anisha Rosna was introduced to the public as the Princess Bride not long ago. Their engagement was officially announced in October 20. 2023. And in early January their luxurious wedding ceremony took place. The celebrations lasted 10 days and included various traditional Muslim rituals. The royal couple exchanged vows during a series of conventional ceremonies on January 7th. Wedding events included a large ceremony at a mosque, an extravagant reception at Brunei's main palace, and a parade through the city streets. The bride wowed the audience with her several wedding dresses, showing off her beautiful figure. Paying tribute to Muslim traditions, Anisha covered her head, although she does not wear a hijab daily. After a 10-day ceremony, Prince Martin and his wife stepped out together for the first time as newlyweds. Journalists compared her look with the look of British princess Kate Middleton. Anisha Rosna looked great in her new role as a royal family member. She'll probably be in the news about royal life a lot from now on, but it's a pity that she does not have her own social media pages, so we won't be able to get information information about her life directly from her. Would you like to follow her page on social networks? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share your comments. See you next time.